Hello there YouTube and welcome to this video on gating. Today I'll be explaining what a gate is and how to use it uh, to get rid of loud mechanical keyboard ticks and, and mouse clicks and so on. So starting off with a definition, a gate is pretty much what you would expect from the meaning of the word. Uh, namely it can either close or open. In this case, um, open means uh, all sound goes through and closed means no sound is coming through. So you can already uh, start to imagine how this is gonna work. Um, when, when the gate is gonna close or open uh, is, is controlled by the threshold. And um, you can th see the threshold right here and you can um, select it at the right level. But uh, before I'm gonna dive into the gate, I'll be uh, closing mine and let you hear what, uh, what a signal might sound like without gating. So you can uh, probably already hear my fans in the background, um, especially when I stop talking, right? That, that's the idea. And also if I start typing, it, it, it might appear to be pretty loud. And this is exactly what you want to get rid of. Uh, there is nothing more annoying, in my opinion, than coming into a stream and you see you see this guy gaming uh, and all you really hear is, is, is mouse clicks and, and, you know, loud mouse clicks and, and keyboard ticks. So that is exactly what you want to get rid of. And it's pretty easy to set up. Um, so I will, I will show you guys if you, if you add the, the regate uh, to OBS, uh, how to set it up. By the way, if you, if you don't know how to do this, I got another video on how to add VSC plugins into OBS. So if you don't know how to do it, you can watch that video first and come back. Uh, if you already know how to do this, then we can dive right into setting up the gate. So uh, when you start out with the, um, with the gate, it will, I will just reset it to, to all the, the standard values. If I would put it on right now, uh, you won't wouldn't hear anything anymore because the threshold is at zero decibel, and unless you're constantly clipping your mic, even then you're not gonna surpass zero decibels. So uh, I was I would suggest starting out that to just put it at minus infinite, um, and then just put put a gate on. So as you can see, it's uh, still everything is going coming through, nothing is happening, and you want to be silent for a few seconds and and see at what level your, your noise is. Okay, so that's, that's about at this level. Let's, let's check it. Right, so now you can, you can hear that if I'm completely silent, then there is no fan noise from uh, the computer coming through. But now the problem is, is that if you start typing, Probably the chances are pretty high that still sound is gonna come through. Like probably even if I if I'm breathing, right? It it will it will already start triggering the gate. So I'll just put it up a bit higher, say like this. Okay, so now it's now it seems good. And if I start typing, it's still coming through, you know. So I'll just put it up a bit more. But the problem now might be. Um, even though it might not be in my case, is that, is that your voice, the beginning of your voice will be cut off because um, the, the, the threshold is, is put up too high. So you might lower it again, but then if you start typing, you might uh, trigger the gate again. Uh, so so this, is, this is a really tough problem to get rid of. Thank goodness though, we do have side chaining and side chaining means that the gate will only look at a specified frequency range uh, that you are giving it and it will only trigger on that on that frequency range and this is pretty useful why because um, voices usually have quite a lot of presence in in the lower frequency ranges whereas keyboards usually have uh, their frequency range you know within the 1000 to 4 5000 hertz frequency range so if you say to your gate look only uh, trigger on 100 between 100 and 300 hertz then if you start talking it's um it, it's pretty easy to get the right threshold and if you start typing then 
probably it's uh i mean uh the the, the gate is not gonna trigger and i will show you guys with uh with the equalizer so as you can see right here uh, when i'm talking all these yellow lines are dancing around that is how how much uh, or high the levels are at a specified frequency so if i will uh if i just for for ease of use uh close the gate now and if you can see me talking right there there is quite a lot of of presence in the around 200 hertz whereas if i'm typing there isn't really much going on except for the background noise of course of course so if you tell your your gate to to trigger at around 200 hertz then it should be much easier to to get the right threshold um for when you're typing so putting the gate back on again, I will say to the high pass filter, which is basically the minimum uh, frequency range to go up to 100 Hertz and the low pass, I will put it all the way down to let's say 400 Hertz. And these are just very rough numbers. You will have to figure this out yourself. Uh, if you are a female, for example, you might have to put it up a bit higher. Whereas if you, well, or, or maybe if your, your, your keyboard is very loud uh, in the lower frequency ranges, you might to have uh, you might need to use other frequencies but usually th this is already a pretty pretty good uh, indicator to start so it looks like this 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 frequency range is still fine if i'm not saying anything there um there is nothing coming through and if i start typing also nothing is happening okay lovely right that's 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 pretty pretty easy to uh to figure out so that is probably it um but i still want to go through the other settings that you see right here the the envelope settings as they call it uh because right now it might still sound a little bit unnatural right because the release is pretty short and therefore it's it's, it's uh closing the gate pretty quickly and i will now go through all the um, the settings and what they mean and how to set it up and then then everything should be fine so pre-open you might need it you might not need it uh, it basically means that the gate is opening uh, before it's getting tricked and the way it, it is doing this is it is delaying the sound by one millisecond and therefore it's looking ahead and if it uh, the signal is triggered uh, the gate will already opened be opened but the, it's uh, you also delay your signal with it. So you might want to use it. You may not want to use it. You'll really have to figure this out yourself. Attack means when the gate will actually open once uh, the threshold is surpassed. So uh, say you know, it's basically what it is, right? The, the signal will surpass the threshold and the gate will wait three milliseconds to open. And basically what you want to do for speech is, is to get it as fast as possible. So between one and three milli milliseconds is, is usually good. Um, hold just really means what it is. Uh, it will hold the gate, so to say. So it will stay open for 100 milliseconds. And or, or I mean zero milliseconds in this case. And then release means how long it takes to again fully close the gate. So um, usually what you want to, to do, or at least in, in my opinion, what, what is a good, good indicator to start with is, is a, a, a release of, of 500 milliseconds and also 100 milliseconds of, of hold. This way, if you, you stop talking, it will still um, uh, keep the gate open a bit and then it will start falling off with the release. Uh, and that way it doesn't really sound you know on off, on off. That is, that is not really what you want. Um, and, and in that way, just the noise is just falling off naturally and uh, everything should be pretty fine. Uh, hysteresis is, is something you uh, probably don't really need. And uh, you might want to look into it, uh, but for most people, it, it shouldn't be needed. So, well, that's about it. Uh, if you have any questions, leave them down in the comments below so I can answer them right there. Uh, I hope this was helpful and see you for the next one.